So what's up guys, I finally memorized Asura. And now you're gonna get a first live experience of me, almost like I'm being tested. So, on three, one, two, three. Alhamdu, Talahi, Rabil, Alameen, Aramani, Rahim. Manikya, Medin, Ia, Kanabudu, Wa Ia, Kanas Tahin, E, Denisara, Dal, Mustakin, Sarata, Ladina, An Amta Alehin, Alairo, McDoobie, Alehan, Walad, La, Dean, Ami. Oh. <laughs> right, Mama Sanoa? Yeah. Oh, let me take my shoes off. Those apartments, I really liked them. Really yeah. liked them. Mama Sanoa, they, oh, they had so nice much clean. Clean. How much closet space they ha did they have? They had right. a lot of closet space. A lot. Uh -huh. I like how the bathrooms are a good size. This is really funny because Justin told me not to unplug the internet thing. No, I didn't unplug it, but I'm uploading a video and now we're starting to lag, which means he's probably going to walk in here. Here he comes. Or wait, no, never mind. But this video is going to be done processing very soon. Anyways, guys, um, they I thought you just told me not to. Uh, so what's up guys, I'm going to be showing you a really fine video, hopefully it doesn't get any copyright, but it's uh, with Brian Wilson, and this is just hilarious, and you guys gotta see this, this is like, see if I can get it full screen. First time they say, hey, you kind of look like a few characters. Chuck Norris, one of them. <laughs> with a little edge. Are you Chuck Norris with a little edge? A tiny bit. How would you relate your pitching to Chuck Norris? Well, Chuck Norris has been known to throw a 100 mile an hour fastball. I've been known to throw Chuck Norris 100 miles an hour. <laughs> that's better. <laughs> that's, that, that's better. So, so Brian, you, you like the water? Not particularly. <laughs> Old Spice? I love Old Spice. Red lobster? I like lobster. Ceviche? Mmm. Yes. <laughs> wow. Wow. I, you so, <laughs> we're all just staring at that saying, what's with the Hemingway drag that he walks out with? I mean, what do you make of Brian Wilson all of a sudden? He here, went man? from being a World Series closer to selling fish sticks. He looks like the Gordon's fisherman. <laughs> <laughs> He's planted up to the hill. I, I, you know, he's a funny dude. I, I, you know, here, here's the deal. If, if you're if you're a closer and you can throw 100 miles an hour, you can pull that off. And this guy has a career as an actor. If it if it ever goes away, how from did you start the show, Joaquin Phoenix? Was like that? when Joaquin Phoenix yeah. came out in character on Letterman, not not dissimilar. Is there any chance he takes that act to the mound, Mitch? I'm telling you, no. <laughs> this, this is the real deal. <laughs> Brian Wilson, God, but he ain't all there. So what's up guys, uh, with this video um, there is a lot that I think I would like to say. Um, I'm going to first start off by saying Matthew, I hope you get a chance to see this part of the video. Um, what I will say is I do know, and for all you guys that watch my videos, I know that my videos are boring. I may not have the type of life that you know you guys would be interested in. I haven't done nothing, anything to make me famous. Um, Strawberry17, she makes music videos, and that's how she can do life for her. I haven't done nothing, and I'm just doing daily videos for that reason. I realize no one views my videos, but I think what this is mainly is for me to be able to reflect on when I'm done. Like, well, I can honestly say I have a whole year in my life. And after I'm done vlogging for a whole year, I think what I'll start doing is I'll only film on days necessary. And for me, for a day to be considered necessary for filming... 
is when I do something that's out of the ordinary. Meaning, if I do something that's common, then on who, why would I want to see that, you know? Why would I want to see what I did when I went to school, came back, did homework, and that's it, you know? Like, the game that I recorded, where I recorded 17-minute videos, and then, like, you know, when I went to my Aunt Baz on Christmas Eve, that, that's stuff that I would want to get on film. But anyways, Matthew, I'm going to say something uh, to you. Um, I thought about maybe we should, we could go to the Giants A's game. It's going to be regular season. It's going to come up on uh, May 20th on a Friday night. And if any of you guys want to go, just let me know on YouTube. Uh, obviously, I'm not famous enough to get worldwide attention. But, um, Matthew, if you're watching this, the tickets would be $37 right now. So I need you to alert me if you'd have 37 bucks. And I don't think you paid us for your ticket. Now, I don't mean to sound pushy or nothing, but we'd appreciate it if you could pay us next time I see you on February 11th. But, yeah, and then also, I'm, uh, I'd am i also like to say one thing. Right now, I'm trying to tell Ricardo about the Fan Fest and everything, and he's not understanding what it is, and I'm not even sure if he wants to go, and I'm going to have to talk to him at school tomorrow. But I want Gabriel to be able to meet Ricardo, and... I'm pretty sure Gabriel's not going to see this video because he doesn't view all my videos because there's too many. He only views the ones that seem entertaining. But uh, I'm going to try to get Gabriel and me, Ricardo, without telling Gabriel that Ricardo is going to FanFest. If Ricardo can't go, then that totally blows that idea. But yeah, anyways, referring back to what um, Matthew, I was telling you, May 20th, Giants and A's in San Francisco, California. It'll be lower. Oh, maybe this is Ricardo right now. Okay, alright guys, Um, I'm going to talk to you later. Ricardo basically just asked if he needs to pay, and uh, I'm going to go, and uh, I'll talk to you guys later. But yeah, Matthew, May 20th, San Francisco, California, lower box seats, 37 a piece, um, should be, should have a lot of fun, and uh, hopefully, I'll talk to you later. Alright, bye.